We're launching the Short-Term Accommodation Association because a group of like-minded, responsible short-term letting companies have come together uh, to represent um, a fast-growing industry um, and to, to further um, the growth of the sector in a responsible fashion. We're working closely with governments, we're working closely with communities, we're working closely with, with neighbourhoods and we want to try to do our best to make sure that this, this sector grows um, in, in as responsible a manner and as, ex as possible so that everybody benefits from this. We've come together because we have the vision of helping to create a responsible industry and grow the industry in a way that benefits the community, that benefits um, the UK as, as a leader in this sector globally. And what we want to do to achieve that is first and foremost to be credible players. So all of our members are part of this organization to grow the industry responsibly, first and foremost. So we're launching our code of conduct, we're thinking about accreditation schemes and how we can continue to build credibility amongst the players in the industry. The second thing is education. We want to be educating not only our customers, but also the wider community about the benefits that we bring as an industry and also about how that can be done responsibly. So all the laws and legislation, health and safety, and all the other things that help us to grow the industry in, in the best possible way. And finally is innovation. This is a new sector and of course with any new sector there are changing elements of it which impact the way things have always been done. Um, and that's everything from the way mortgage companies write mortgages um, and allowing people to have flexibility with their own assets through to the way leases in this country are written um, and the ability of people to monetize that home when they're away themselves. This benefits people like retirees. It benefits workers who want to have more flexible lifestyles um, and, and allows that as our economy and, and, and as people look for more flexibility in their lives, they have all the options available to them. Um, and we believe that working together with all these industries um, and, and innovating and continuing to grow this industry, that's something that will benefit consumers and will benefit the UK overall. So this evening we're lucky to be hosted by Lord Bourne, who is going to be speaking about the launch of the association uh, and how we can work with government and the impact that we can have as a new industry body. We also have with us some journalists, members um, from the association, as well as other people within the industry and other people within areas of government who are interested in our sector. So we're hoping this will be an event that will allow people to discuss the direction of the industry and also look for opportunities of, of how we can work together and collaborate moving forward. Well, I think it is, it is important in, in this time to have information, access to information and the possibility to discuss uh, developments in the market. Um, if, you're, if you're trying to, to manage both business as well as all the regulatory discussions, um, discussions with the government, discussions with the media. Uh, it is important to, to have a group and share uh, in a way that, um, that, uh, that activity. So I think one thing is, is really the, uh, the information flow. It, we're, we're not in, uh, working in isolation uh, as an industry. We, we have information coming from uh, London, we have information coming from the UK, but we have information from Europe and also internationally. This is, this is a discussion that is, uh, is held globally and I think their members can really benefit from getting uh, the insights of what, what is happening around uh, the globe, what are best practices from other areas, how can we, how can we help everybody to create a sustainable uh, long-term, short-term rental market. Uh, for the Short Term Rental Association, we're really pleased to have a whole wide range of people ranging from large global players like uh, ourselves, Airbnb and HomeAway, to local homegrown startups like Under the Doormat and Air Agents. This is a really fast growing sector and there's a lot of excitement about it, but together we need to work, work on what's the best way to be able to continue to grow, to provide great stays, to have happy hosts, but also to grow responsibly and sustainably.
So today's our launch, and that's an exciting step because we're launching our code of conduct and also our policy paper. Uh, what we want to continue doing is building on the relationships that we've initiated um, to help on the policy side. So things like supporting the collaborative economy work that they're doing in Scotland, working with London councils and DCLG, um, working with Bayes and how we can cooperate with other industries, um, and educating uh, our members as well as the consumers who are looking to participate in this industry. So as we grow our membership, we'll be able to reach much wider and do more and more activities and events around these elements to help grow the industry in a responsible way.